Hey, and welcome to another episode of Sweet Life Design. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to set up this cute mimosa bar or mamosa bar that I have set up behind me. This is an easy setup that you can do using some of the things that you have around your house. So if you're interested in, see interested in seeing this beautiful setup, stay tuned. For starters, we're going to set the base for our bar. I picked up this tray at Pier 1. Next, I have this marble turnstile that I picked up from TJ Maxx. Now, choosing a drink of your choice or a juice of your choice, you want to go ahead and add it to your tray. You can also label your jars to be more specific to what the juice is. Now moving on to the good part, I picked up this Barefoot Bubbly Moscato Champagne. And for the non-drinkers, I picked up this Sparkling Mimosa. And lastly, this Sparkling Blush Apple Cider. cute napkins I picked up from Target, they say raise the glass. I thought they were perfect for this occasion. Frozen fruit is optional. I decided to go with blueberries, blackberries, and strawberries. I picked up this cute bicycle planter from the Target dollar spot. Any celebration without cupcakes is just a meeting. I made these cute buttercream cupcakes, some with sprinkles and some just plain vanilla. Lastly, we're gonna add our champagne flutes. I picked up these flutes from the Target Dollar Spot. They are plastic. Backdrop for our mimosa bar is going to be these flower arrangements that I picked up from Ross stores. This was of course before the pandemic and I'm going to hang them up with my trusty tack. You can also DIY these by getting some wire and connecting them to make the shape of your choice and then just adding the florals. Here's our mom mosa bar completed and ready to go for Mother's Day.
guys enjoyed this video and I hope you have a very safe and special Mother's Day with that special woman in your life. Until my next video, stay sweet and cheers. Have a great day. Bye.